Hey everybody, I am finally doing a My Adult Coloring Book Collection video. I've had several people message me and ask me about it. They want to see my collection. Um, sometimes you just don't have the time, but today I do and I'm just going to do, you know, show you a few of them. I'm not going to go through every single book. Um, like a flip through because I have either reviewed the book and it's on my channel you can go take a look or I am going to be reviewing these books so just um, stick around and I will be reviewing these books page by page um, sooner or later so um, let's get started this is the book that started it all this is my Jane Austen book um, it's actually like um, those removable cards you know you can just perforate you can take out um, and frame up or whatever but um, first book this got the obsession started my daughter actually got this for me for Christmas um, this year so um, that one's close to my heart this book is a recent purchase Bizarro Land uh, my first I think first creative haven book I really really like it so far um, I haven't started in it yet um, but I just did a review on this if you want to see the entire inside it's very 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 cute um, this book was sent to me by Lynn Reeves it is so fun I actually really love this book but I'm not going to open it up yet because I am about to do a review on it so um, watch out for that um, this book I've been seeing a lot on the internet and I had to have it Tanglewood by Jessica Palmer it is just a stunning very very beautiful book um, I have not colored anything in it yet I just received it maybe two weeks ago um, this book was sent to me by Kim Jordan Blair. It's called Beautiful Flowers. Let me go out of it. It's called Beautiful Flowers. And she has a lot of really cute little whimsical pages in here. Um, I've also, I will also be doing a review on this book. So um, keep an eye out for that. All right, let's get a few more here. This one I just recently did a um, review on, The Big Monster Book. I've done several pages in here. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to do this book just watercolor. It's just it's a gorgeous book. I really, really love it. It was a little more pricey than the other books, but um, Juliet Crane has been around the arts and journaling and all that kind of stuff for a long time, and I love all of her work, so I had to have this book. Doodlers Anonymous. What can I say? I think this has to be one of my absolute most favorite books. It is just so fun. Um, I, I've done this picture. I just love this picture. This is the first one I did in here. But it's it's all kinds of different artists and that's the books I love when you can go in and you can see 90 different artists in one book. I love this book. I really highly recommend it. This is the last book I purchased. I forgot whose show I was watching. Um, it's the Color Special Fix by Helen Elliston. And it's basically a tutorial on everything you need to know about coloring. So I'm really excited to start working in this book. And I will do a review on that when I'm finished. This is another book I just got. This is The Best of Color It. And these were on sale. I'll have to turn it this way to open it up because it does have a top end. Um, uh, these were on sale because their books are a little pricey. I didn't want to, I haven't wanted to pay full price for them. They're like $15, $16. So this one came on sale and it was like half price. It was like five bucks. Um, so I went ahead and purchased it so I could try it out and test it. I have not reviewed that one yet, but I will be. These books, everybody has them. Enchanted Forest, great book. Joanna Basford. Um, let me see. I think I've done I've done Bird in here. I think that's all I've done in here, to be honest. No, I did the map. Okay, love this book. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Fairy Tales. I'm falling in love with this book too. This book is just beautiful. I can't wait to get her new book she just came out with. Let me see. I did the mushroom and I did the octopus in this one. Alrighty. Um, this one is by Monique Day Wild. It's called Country Dreams. I have not done anything in this book yet, but I did do a review on it. 
It's very, very cute. It's a little small size book. Um, the Mindless Coloring Book. I purchased this at the book outlet, I believe. I've only done this one picture. This is another one that has um, a lot of different little doodles, very small type um, pages in it that you can get done quickly. I really like that. These two books are by Adriana Picker. Um, the first one is The Garden of Earthly Delights that came out. Um, I did a few of these with my Coronor um, Tritone pencils. That might be all I did in this book. I can't remember. Um, it's a beautiful book. I love the um, rose gold foiling on the cover. And this is her uh, second book that just recently came out. I just got this uh, a couple of weeks ago. I don't think I colored anything in here yet, but I, I do have a review up on this book. This is a gorgeous book that was sent to me by Happiness Oncario. Um, it's a beautiful book, um, Women in African Print and Fashion. She has such beautiful detail for fashion. I did this one, not finished yet. I just had to color her little face. Um, just a gorgeous, gorgeous, really pretty book. And I did this one. Uh, you can pick this up. Every, most of these you can pick up on Amazon. This one is the Native American Painted Pony Trail of the Painted Ponies. And it's by different artists. This is the Native American edition. And you have this gallery here. And it tells you which artist colored which um, pick, I'm not colored, drew which picture. So I picked, where is it? This one, the Spirit War Pony. Um, I'm going to be doing a few more in these too. And there's a pullout poster that is really great in here. Let's see if I can, here it is. I showed it on the video. It's like five panels wide, so I'm not going to open it all up. But this is the cover is embossed. It's just really nice. Very, very well quality book. This is The Art of Coloring by Tom West, another gorgeous, gorgeous book I love. Very high quality, really nice, thick book, thick pages. Oh, this is the only one I've colored in it so far. His lines and details are just amazing. I just want to color all of them. And he gives you examples. That's what I like. He gives you examples of some of these. So, um, really great book. These are all the norms that everybody has. I'm not going to take too much time on these. Um, let me just flip through a couple that I've done. That's the other one. I think I'm going to do a background, but I haven't decided what I want to do on this yet. Summer Nights by Hannah Carlson. Twilight Garden by Maria Troll. Beautiful, beautiful book. Uh, did I do any in here? I think I did. I always, if you see the blue stickers on the book, I always mark, oh yeah, I did this one. I always mark the next page that I want to do when I go back to that uh, particular book. Magic Dawn, another Hannah Carlson book. This is a really, really nice book too. I think this is the only one that I've done in here so far. Yes, it's the only one I've done in that one. Another Hannah, Hannah Carlson, Daydreams. Her books, they're just stunning. I already pre-ordered her next one. I, I want to say it's coming out in August. I did these two. These are my first two pages I've done um, after the initial um, book that I got in December for my daughter. I waited for this for so long. I love this book. Oh my goodness, it came from overseas and it took forever to get here and I just love it I'm hoarding it I guess this is the page I did um, I did this one I did the bookmark that comes with it I just love this book um, it is from Clara Markova and I don't remember what the translation was for the title sorry here we go. We've got some Kirby Rosani's. Pretty much if you're into coloring books, you know about Kirby Rosani's. 
this is one other one of my early books that I got. Um, I think I've colored two in here. I love, love, love his style. But I've heard, oh, I did three. I've heard that he's going to be changing up his style this year. I don't know if that's true or next year. This is one of his Anamorphia books. Everybody knows these. Everybody has these. This is the latest one I did in his book. I think that's the only one I've done in here. Yep. Imagimorphia. I have not bought Mythomorphia yet. I'm not sure why. I love this book. I mean, this page it came out really, really good. I was really, really happy with that page. I think that's it for this one, too. Okay, now let me grab some more. This one is, I don't, do not know how to pronounce it. Poe Druggy Stony Snoo. I don't know. I apologize. I know that's probably wrong. By Carolina Kubikoski. She has another book that I want. Ticket to Dreams. Oh, so gorgeous. Her books are amazing. They're worth the price. They're worth the wait. I cannot wait to get her other one. It's, they're just stunning. This is the only picture I've done so far. I did this as a live stream, so you can catch that on my site if you want to. Great, great book. The Mysterious Library. This was a really good book I've been wanting for a while also. Illustrated by NG Park. I think I've done one page in here. This one. Oops, I this book. Really, really pretty. Mysterious Library. Color My Sketchbook by Bennett Klein. I don't know if I'll get any more. I, I mean, I, this was really good. This is one of my favorite pictures that I've done by him. Uh, I'm going to color this one for sure. But, I don't know. They're not my favorite books. This one is called Magilla's Magical Coloring Book. I haven't done anything in this one yet. I need to do a review and color this one. This is a pretty good little book. Um, what else we got? Fairy Shampoo. I love this book. I love it, love it, love it. I saw it at Barnes & Noble's and they wanted full price and I wasn't going to pay full price. So I went to Amazon and I got it for like five bucks. <coughs> This is from Jo Su Jin. Um, it's all hair, all about the different hair. Uh, let me see. This is the one that I colored in here so far. And I've not done a review on this, so I will be doing a review on this one. All oh, Colin Thompson. I don't know what this translates into. No idea. But this is another one of my most favorite books ever. He has the best books. <clears throat> Excuse me. I did a review on this one, I believe. Or I'm going to be doing a review. This is the first book, first page I did in this book. Sorry, I'm trying to get these done fast, this video done fast. And this is the second one that I did. This took me a long time, but it was so worth it when it was finished. I absolutely love this page. Mythical Lands of, I think it's Yukana, Yukana by Karen Myers. Really, really pretty book. Another grayscale type, some of the pages. Very whimsical. This is the only one that I have done. And these, um, this page was done using the new Black Widow Spider Pencils. Very vibrant, beautiful colors. Little Spider Pencils. Um, I did another video on that, so you can check that out on my channel. Astro Inklings by Tanya Bond. This is my first Tanya Bond book, and I have to say it's really, really pretty. I like how this is only one I've done so far, Aquarius, because I'm Aquarius. Um, I'm going to get some more of her books because I love doing faces. I like how she gives you two copies. Um, this one is Make Something Beautiful by Barry J. Or Barry J. I'm not sure. I love the gold foil on the cover. It's a beautiful book. It really is. It takes all mediums beautifully. Markers. Um, this was an alcohol based the Ohu markers. And it does bleed right through. But as long as you have something to protect on your next page, it really doesn't matter. Uh, I think I did one other this one. This is all watercolor. 
and I just love how it came out. I'm going to put it in a frame, I think. I haven't done a review on this book, so watch out for that one. It's called Precious Animals by Angela um, Ragu. I hope I'm pronouncing that right, Angela. This book is really, really cute. She sent this to me. She has um, where you have double the pages, so like if you mess up on one, you can go back to the other, or you can test items, you know, your mediums on one half of the book. I think I started on one of these. Yeah, I started on the cat. I need to finish him up. But it is a great, great book. You will love this book. It's a nice, big book. Good quality. Um, it's on Amazon, so check her out. This is the Four Seasons Coloring Book by Akayo Fukawa. Um, have not colored in this book yet, but it is really, really cute. It's kind of a Joanna Basford ish with a lot of the um, whimsical stuff in it. That's why I picked it up. I really liked it. A little different. Um, it's one of the last stacks. This is Creative Haven Fanciful Faces. And this is by. Miriam Adato and her books are really really beautiful I think this is the only one I've done in here so far lots of faces which are my favorite to do the neon coloring book I was surprised at how much I really liked this book when I got it from the book outlet it was very inexpensive it was in the dents and dangs I believe it was like three bucks or something like that but some of it's already pre-colored for you and I just like flipping through it. It's just really pretty. I did a few little bitty things, you know, here and there like that. Nothing major, but I really, really like this book. And I did a video on both of these books, so you can check them out. And I'm going to flip through them outside the lines. And I had outside the lines too. Um, I gave my sister one of them. This book is really, really nice. I marked the heck out of this book. Um, I have a lot of pages that I want to do. Adult Coloring Book Treasury 2. There's 130 um, illustrations from 70 different artists. And I did do a video on this one, so you can check that out. Nice big book. You, and they're very inexpensive. Oh, this one. <laughs> this one, sorry if you're... um don't like the sweary words this one is a swear word coloring book very very cute if you like that it is what it is okay these are the rest of my books this one is um her name is Bree and she's doodles of the north she's in Alaska and her work is really really beautiful I don't have the example that I colored because my daughter actually hung it up in her little office so um, these are really really nice you can get these off of her Etsy site these I love these books the chickadee coloring book I did do a video on let me back this up I did do a video on this digital book um, it's by Robert Rascom and I just recently got his next book or the book he sent called Whimsical Forest. His books are adorable. I just love them. And I love that you can just print them out right away and just start coloring in them. This is the one I'm working on right now from Whimsical Forest. The little peace tree. Um, the coloring book. Uh, you can see that one on my, um, on my channel. There's a couple of them in here that we did. That one. There's one more in here. Yeah, this one. But what's great about these is you can print them. You can make as many copies as you want. If you mess up, who cares? Start over. This is another one called The Adult Coloring Book by Steve and Carol. And this one is an abstract type book. I did a, um, this is the only one I did in this book. I did a review on this one. You can check that out. And I think that might be my last book. I have a kitten book somewhere, but I couldn't find it. But, um, yeah, I appreciate you checking out my collection. And in a couple months, I'm sure I'll have double this amount at the rate I'm going. So please come back and check me out. I really appreciate you watching if you got this far. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.